Hi guys, it's Tuesday, but probably Wednesday for you. Shopping trip highlights. All right, so today I went to three stores. I don't often go to Christmas tree shops, but when I do, they always are satisfying. <laughs> they never disappoint me. I mean, most of the stuff is a lot of junk, but if you can get past all that and find the diamonds in the rough, then it all pays off. I also went to Target and Sam's Club. So, let us begin. Alright, let's start over here. Um, well, this I've had my eye on for a while. This really beautiful, uh, like, raspberry sorbet eternity scarf from Target. Forget how much it was originally. Um, should be, a, there we go. It was originally 15 and I got it for $4.48, so I guess that's 75% off. That was a good deal. I got this uh, these green hearts for the front door for St. Patrick's Day because my St. Patrick's Day wreath is like cooked. That was like a dollar ninety nine. I want to say is that right? That was so cheap. Yes, a dollar ninety nine at Christmas tree shop. So that's really cool. I don't like to spend a lot of money on decorations, which is usually why I make them. So to have a store like Christmas tree shops where they have the stuff like so cheap that I can't. I can't argue. <laughs> it's great because then I don't have to waste my time like doing crafts even though it's therapeutic and fun and everything but it, life is hectic <laughs> especially with YouTube. Alright, um, Christmas Tree Shops has really good prices on uh, cosmetics and uh, beauty care items as well. So they had the Ren Pure for $3.99 I want to say. It might have been $2.99 but $3.99 is good too. This is the one that Kristen likes. My foxy hair needs fixin'. Uh, I also picked up the Shiny Silver Ultra Conditioning Shampoo. This one, I think, is pretty much the same as the Shimmer Lights by Clairol, except this one's cheaper for the 12 ounces. I think this was $4.99, and I think the Clairol one for the 16 ounces was like $7.99. So it's, you know, pretty similar, but they're both purple. And they're both, you know, they all look like the Joyco, which I really like. So the Joyco is really expensive. The Joyco is like $14, um, but it's a pretty big bottle. But I'd rather pay $4.99. Wouldn't you? All right, I'm obsessed with the LED lights. I picked up the ones at Sam's Club. They're okay. I'm going to use these in the bathroom because that's when the lights stay on a lot. These only say that they last for, I think it was, yeah, eight years. I like 46 years better. They're the same price as the other ones, by the way. They're not as bright, but these say they only last 8 years. Who's lying? <laughs> 46 years? 8 years? Hmm. Alright, I picked this up for Sean. Um, whoops! Puss in Boots uh, dual pack. Uh, he loves Puss in Boots. We haven't seen this yet. Uh, I also got the bonus, the three Diablos. I think that looks really cool. I think he's really going to enjoy Aww. that. Can you pick that up, Chris, please? I just dropped Kristen's... This is mine. Yes. I don't want to show you, though, because you... I don't want to show you a shirt. <laughs> All right. So, Kristen's been begging me for, to pick this up for her, and most stores don't have it anymore because I don't think they're making it anymore. The Maybelline Mineral Power Concealer. She's used this since high school. Well, not this one, but <laughs> she's been using it since high school. Right, but she loves it. She says it gives really good coverage, so and it doesn't make her face break out even more. So it's very good. Maddie loves the um, Elf eyeliner and shadow stick, as you re as you've seen in her video from yesterday, I think it was, or two days ago. By the time you watch this, so I picked her up another one that was three dollars at Christmas tree shops. And by the way, the only place that had this was Christmas tree shops, the um, Maybelline Mineral Power. I really like this <laughs> Advil and it's that time of the year. It's getting really bad now with allergies and everything. I think the pollen's going to be erupting soon. I also picked this up at Target because I want to try and keep uh, track of everyone's birthdays and anniversaries and everything so you guys don't have to remind me all the time. I think that would be cool and just not pay so much attention to the year but just keep a running tab on everybody's birthday. For my family too because I have relatives and it's like, oh, it's your birthday? I didn't know. How embarrassing. <laughs> I 
I picked up a preemptive wreath for the door for Easter at Christmas tree shops. Um, this was pretty cheap and it's really cute. $4.99. It's got a little eggs that dangle in the middle. I think that was cute. Of course, I'm not going to monkey with it now. Kristen asked for a wide tooth comb. And my comb. mommy's so good to me. I asked her for that like a week ago and she remembered. Oh, too bad I only remember the trivial things. Here, it's yours, darling. Thank you, mommy. Wide tooth comb because Kristen has a freaking lioness mane. Right now it's down to like almost her underwear. What? <laughs> In the back. The oh, hair I think like... meant I was only wearing my underwear. No. But, uh, fully dressed. I anyway. know. No, your hair is very, very, very long. It needs to be chopped. Alright, uh, Christmas Tree Shops is also really good for the spices. These were both 89 cents. I love Starbucks. What more do you need to know? Uh, they had it on sale for $7.99, so I wanted to try a lighter blend for a change. I usually get all dark roast. I want to, you know, switch it up a little bit. So I went with the Blonde Willow Blend because I remember when Mark and I were looking during Mark Week. <laughs> this one smelled really good to me, so yeah. Maddie's coming home, so I need to stock up on stuff for her. I got some peanut butter here. The two-pack at Sam's Club with seven and change. This is kind of a fun little office uh, sticky note cube. Can you believe this was only a dollar? Unbelievable. There's 750 sheets in there. You know how much the Post-it brand costs? Ridic. I've been wanting one of these for a long, long time, but I didn't want to pay the TV price of $10. <laughs> So they got it for $5.99. Watch, you guys can probably find that in the dollar store by you, but I like the one with the handle. Now, I'm, I'm drinking um, my iced tea that I got at ShopRite, the uh, Arnold Palmer one that was only 5 calories, but I don't really have a nice container to keep it in. So I found this one, which is I think is really nice, and I see why it's really nice. It's from Pier 1. But it was at Christmas tree shops, so apparent this was originally fifteen dollars. So apparently, Christmas tree shops gets all of the liquidation things from more expensive stores because someone left that sticker on there, <laughs> and the other ones like it had that sticker too. So it wasn't like somebody just came in and tried to scam me by putting a Pier One sticker on there. So I think it what was it four nine yeah three ninety nine. $3.99 down from $15, so good deal, right? Dewberries, because Maddie's coming home. Well, these aren't going to last till Maddie gets home, but don't those look delicious? They are huge. Eggs, because I'm vegetarian, not vegan. Uh, Maddie has been waiting for this to come out in paperback for probably like a year now or more. The girl who kicked the hornet's nest, so yeah, it finally came out. I picked it up. Six bucks at Sam's Club. Kristen, look, I got you focaccia with rosemary on it. I'm going to have that for Oh, how nice. <laughs> Daddy's ciabatta rolls. All right, here's the healthy section. And Kristen wants to be healthy, too, now. She's like, I want more fruits and veggies to snack on. Well, I got celery and baby tomatoes. I want to clean them lettuce. at the beginning of the week, put them in a storage container, and then you don't have to worry Oh, about someone has been watching the Sherman vlog. I had that idea <laughs> months right. and months ago, and All I right. told you. Don't you remember? Blueberries, because she loves these frozen blueberries. Uh, carrots. These are new apples to me. I haven't tried this kind yet. Pacific Rose. It's all the way at the top of the sweet scale, so interesting. I think it is anyway. If you touch me again, you're gonna pull back a bloody stump. Go get in the shower, Kristen. <laughs> spread it because I didn't want everyone to know, Mom. Well, now they do. Out there. Not oh. the people watching you, but like. Uh, damage control. Go get in the shower. <laughs> Protein bars, because these are Mark's favorite now with the uh, peanut butter and dark chocolate. Kristen's favorite tortilla chips. My chicken patties, which I love and which are only 140 calories, so that's pretty cool. Kristen, instead of getting the um, the fried chicken like in the frozen bag, because she used to eat that for lunch every day, now we're getting the chicken breast in the cans. Got less fat, but probably got more sodium. So, eh, 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 one or another, right? I picked up my corned beef already for um, St. Patrick's Day. Guess what? I'm not eating it. <laughs> 
So now my sisters, who think my husband is suffering from lack of meat, can zip it because you don't even get it. Sorry. <laughs> everybody, well, not everybody, but my sisters think that you actually need meat to live. Hello. I haven't had meat for two years and I'm not like anemic or anything. I don't know what to say. I think you just need to zip it. All right. Over here, I mean that in the nicest way, anyway. All right, this is a um, eggplant upside down planter. You know, they have the, um, they make these in tomato too. <laughs> you know those as seen on TV ones? It's like upside down pepper plant, upside down tomato plant. If you live in, you know, two feet, two square feet of space, you can hang this out on your porch and blah, blah, blah. I have plenty of space. You've seen my yard, but I do like to hang up plants outside my porch. So I thought, wow, this would be really neat. And the best part is, if it's hanging up, Verdell won't go down into the garden and pee on it. <laughs> so it's dually good. <sighs> All right, I think, is this the last item? No, it's not. All right, Fiber One brownies. Um, remember, I'm doing a little, this is what happened to them. <laughs> Where are they now? That's what it is. I'm doing a little where are they now. Remember the Vita Tops that I, I think I bought them last week? They were horrible. I didn't like them. Maybe I didn't prepare them right. I kind of ate them frozen. Maybe I should have heated it up or something. But they were all like, these are so chocolatey good and delicious. You will love them. I didn't love them. But I do love these brownies. The Fiber One 90 calorie brownies. Pretty satisfying. They're not huge but pretty satisfying if you are on a diet or if you've got constipation issues. I don't know. <laughs> why, on, why on earth else would you need them unless you were on a diet or you couldn't go to the bathroom? So cross off constipation issues. I'm on a diet. <laughs> so I really like these. And of course more lettuce and milk. And yeah, I got them. The peanut butter Cheerios. They weren't $4.50 like they were in ShopRite. At Target, they had them for $3.50. And I also got another box of Honey Nut Cheerios because Mark likes that one. And that was on sale for $2.99. Target actually had a really decent selection of the Cheerios. Unfortunately, the only one that was on sale was the Honey Nut. But they had banana and something, banana and straw. I don't know. Was it banana and strawberry? It's banana something. <laughs> banana nut bread? I don't know. They have chocolate and the caramel and um, all different ones. So if you hanker in for the flavor of a Cheerios, <laughs> go to Target. Yay! Big Daddy's home. It's Yay. the best time of the day. My hairstylist. <laughs> Today? Yeah. I'm tired. Me too, but it's hey, I gotta get done. You want me to look like a cheap hoe? No, an expensive hoe. That's exactly what I was thinking. Exactly. What'd you get today? Looks like you got presents. I got a knife or oh, I got two knives. Nice. This is a shrade. That's a hot, hot color. Mm. I don't know if it's showing up on the camera, but it's this beautiful, um, what would you say, electric blue? Yeah. Not a tealish yeah. electric blue. It's a double-ended. Yes, it has two locking blades. Mm -hmm. One serrated and one plain. Nice. I kind of wish it would flick open with one. <clears throat> yeah, well, I like that other one. You got better. One finger. Well, that's a cheap, really cheap. Yeah, well, show us that one. That one's, I like it. I think it's hot. eBay straight from China Special. I like the looks of it. It's much bigger and heavier. Yeah, I'm going to say. Oh, this one's like weighs nothing. Yeah. That one's hot. It's just Give me a respect the knife. Craftsmanship is not all there. Yeah. It's pretty hot. I could see that on the uh, 3 o'clock in the morning home shopping network. Oh, yeah. <laughs> swords and all kinds of stuff on there. Yeah. Yeah, but this one does have that nice little... Yeah, I like that a lot. Flicking, spring-assisted. Oh, I like the, uh, the little clip there to like put it in your pocket or whatever. This one has it's hot. A also. And I like the cutout on this one. Yeah, what is the purpose of that? 
you can use your thumb to open the blade with that. Oh, oh, I, I okay. I may have to loosen this one up a little bit, but yeah, you can open it like that. Yeah. Never know when I'm gonna have to uh, need that. Never know. <laughs> you need to open a package or something. Exactly. Nice. Excellent, honey. So we're gonna have some fun tonight, right? What do you uh, call fun? <laughs> Define fun for me. Well. First, we're gonna fix my hair, meaning you're gonna um, put the hair bleach on it. <laughs> then we're going to have no. Well, first we're gonna have dinner. Then he's gonna do my hair. Then I'm gonna dry it, and then we're going to the bed chamber for sleeping. <laughs> we'll finally get to sleep. Yes, sleep is the best, isn't it? It is a wonderful thing. It's a wonderful. Let's see how sharp this is. Sean, how was school? It's wonderful. <laughs> it's not terribly no. sharp. No. We'll have to sharpen it. Okay. Give it a stone or something. No, we have to get one. All right. All right? Okay, honey. Well, I thoroughly enjoyed that, as yeah. I'm sure everyone else did. They did not ship this sharpened. You have to sharpen that. Oh, why do they? I don't know. I guess uh, some manufacturers just don't do that. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> well, I enjoyed our time together, honey, for Mark past week. <laughs> Alright, give up the Mark week. It's over. No! I can't. I won't. I refuse. This okay. has gone on far too long. Yes. Goodbye. Goodbye. Till next time. Much love. <laughs>